been a really exciting film to work with because it kind of took you a little bit to your your childhood because you did have a connection to pigeons. Yeah, um, it's weird. My I, my grandfather and father were preeminent pigeon racers in the '60s in Johannesburg, South Africa, and uh, John Gaydon, who gave me the script, had no idea about that. But he asked me if I wanted to read this weird little script he wrote about pigeon racing, and I had this connection, so I instantly wanted to read the film um, and fell in love with the material for more than just the pigeons, for what the people are going through in the movie. Um, but it was, it, it felt weirdly meant to be. And then I understand that you're also a fan of Susan Orland's writing. Yes, for sure. Um, I inhaled the New Yorker magazine and so was familiar with her work from the New Yorker magazine and a lot of her pieces surrounding animals. My father's a veterinarian, so um, uh, animals have been a big part of my life growing up and a big part of Susan's life and Susan's writing. Um, so when, you know, that I saw that the script was based on one of her articles, that was, um, you know, really special. And the, and, and the article itself is just a wonderful piece of writing. And I think that the themes that are present in that article come through ultimately in the film. I personally love animals, all sorts of animals, more than people. Mm. So for me, this was a joy. So what was it like to have these extra characters, pigeons, on set, and how do you how do you direct them? We raised, uh, the animal handlers and trainers uh, raised 60 pigeons for this movie, and um, the ones who are our lead pigeons are credited in the film, at the end of the film, um, and... You know, I picked the, the breeds of pigeons that I, I wanted to play the lead pigeon roles, and they spent a lot of time training them. And it was always fun when the pigeons were on set. It was always, well, first of all, everyone has to be really quiet. You don't want to distract the pigeons, so that's nice. So everyone's on their best behavior when the pigeons are there, which I like. And um, it's just fun. It's just nice. They just bring a nice, warm, cute, you know, energy. Um to the set, which is always needed on a, on a movie set. I enjoyed the film. I had tears of joy and sadness. Did you feel that while filming? Definitely. I mean, I felt it when I read the script, and I really wanted to capture it when we were, we were making the film. And I'm, you know, I'm so glad people have that reaction uh, because that was the that was the intention to really make it an emotional journey. You definitely took myself to, <laughs> to this incredible journey, and I will see pigeons in different eyes. Good, I'm glad to hear it. <laughs> Thank you so much for your time. Thank you.